Have you ever dreamt of a trip to space? To explore the vast universe? Commercial space flights are now offering that opportunity, the likes of Blue Origin and Virgin Galactic. And there you can see a clean separation between the capsule and the booster. Traveling to space has become much easier, especially when you have a few million dollars. But in this new era of space tourism, have you ever wondered what happens if you die in space? What happens to the body if someone meets their cosmic demise up there? If you take your final breath in the vast expanse of space, don't just expect your body to drift off into the cosmos. Instead, there is a long and strict protocol. Under the international space law, countries are responsible for all space activity. It could be by the government or by private agencies. But it's the country that bears responsibility. So if someone dies in space, the first thing to do is determine the cause. If it's a natural death, then the next question is, what happens to the body? Imagine someone dies on a low earth orbit mission, like on the International Space Station. Then the body is returned immediately. The crew puts the body in a capsule and it is sent back to the earth in a matter of hours. Again, if it happens on the moon, the protocol is the same. The body is sent back immediately. It reaches the earth in a few days. Sounds easy peasy, right? But it really isn't. Things are a little more complicated on a longer trip, like maybe a trip to Mars. Of course, then the crew cannot just return to earth. So the body is kept in a separate chamber or maybe a body bag. The steady temperature and humidity help preserve the body. And when the mission returns to Earth, the body returns with it. Now, this is when they die in the spacecraft. But what happens when they die on the surface, like on the Mars? Now, of course, cremation is not possible. It requires too much energy. Burial too isn't such a great idea. It could contaminate the surface of the planet. Instead, the crew is likely to preserve the body in a specialized body bag. It is kept in that until they return to the Earth. Human space exploration began just 60 years ago. Since then, 20 people have died in space. 14 of them were NASA space shuttle tragedies, 3 in the 1971 Soyuz mission, and 3 in the Apollo 1 launch pad fire of 1967. No one has died on Mars yet. But with space tourism booming, it could soon be a possibility. And if you step out of a spacecraft without a suit, it is a sure shot. You would die almost instantly. Even your body wouldn't return to space. Your remains will gradually break down into space dust. So if you want the cosmos to be your resting place, you can help by adding a pinch of stardust to the universe. Who knows, maybe you will become the secret ingredient for the galaxy's next star formation?